Welcome aboard, I'm Jason Navargo. This is Battlefleet Gothic 2. We are here with skirmish battles. I am going to be playing as the Tyranids first and foremost because they are my favorite faction, but there are many, 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 many others to choose from. You have the Tau, who are now split into the Protector and Merchant fleets. Uh, basically, the Tau Protector fleet is the more typical Tau fleet with all their well-known ships. The Merchant fleet is all their, you know, vassal races and stuff. You got the Necrons, the Orcs, the Dark Eldar, the... Uh, good Eldar, and also Eldar Pirates, Chaos, the Adeptus Mechanicus, who are now their own fleet, the Space Marines, and the Imperial Navy. But as I said, I'm going to be playing as the Tyranids, High Fleet Leviathan, because they're awesome. Uh, and here we have some skills, which I suppose we will get more of as we unlock uh, faction experience, which I don't think is going to be happening in the scope of the beta. But my skills, I think, are going to be Psychic Scream, uh, in which you emanate a Psychic Scream, and you suffer, and every ship around you suffers a massive morale penalty, or at least every enemy ship, which is just friggin' awesome. The Wrecking Biomorph Ball is exactly what it sounds like. The Hive Shit spits out a giant ball, and just knocks back everything, and deals damage ignoring shields, which is also pretty awesome. So this is kind of a close-range Tyranid uh, composition, but that's basically what the Tyranids are for. They rush in quick, and they eat enemy ships alive with lots of boarding actions and stuff. Uh, with that in mind, I think high-density bioplasma and predator instincts are going to be pretty great. Now then, to create my fleet, what are we going to do? We're going to have a skirmish for 1v1, 1v1 me fools. Ah, okay. Now, we're going to create a custom fleet for the Tyranids, which is going to be pretty freaking awesome. We're going to omnom our way through the entire galaxy, if you don't mind. We got Infestation Devourer, Corrosive Tentacles, Corrosive Tentacle Devourer. They have Pyro Acid Battery Weapons and Bioplasma Battery Weapons. And pretty much every big... Oh my gosh, what is this? Massive Claws. Are those the guys that rush in and uh, actually eat enemy ships? Because I was looking at these tentacles here. Uh, those basically attack enemy ships' crews. And if you... That's that's part of the Tyranid strategy. Rush in and eat everybody. Leave the ship a drifting hulk. And move on to the next one. Of course, we're going to have a hive ship first and foremost. Or we can have a biotentacle hive ship, which is, also, which is again, very close range... Uh, but it looks like they have some carrier capability with a launch bay. Infestation hive ship. What does that do? Super heavy pyro acid artillery, which has incredibly long range of 13,000 units. Okay, and a launch bay. The bio acid hive ship has artillery, launch bays, and just a whole mess of guns. The typical hive ship has... looks like much more close range combat stuff. I do want to take advantage of the Pyro Acid's uh, skill, and I do like launch bays. Now, the Hive Ship is important. It's important to keep it to the back because Tyranid ships, they are heavily affected by morale. Uh, if the Hive Ship goes down, their morale plummets, and they basically lose their connection to the Hive Mind, and they just go insane, and they just go off to do their own thing. So we're fairly range heavy actually or at least we're going to be depending a lot on our pyro acid stuff let's name our fleet uh the uh the acid throwers fine by me and we'll be picking the acid floors and who do we want to actually fight the uh, servants of the imperium sound pretty tasty and our first battle of course is probably going to be against whatever uh, the humans uh, try to send at the at the hive fleet, which of course will come to nothing. There we are. We all start out stealthed, which is why they look like that. But <laughs> they look pretty dang awesome, if you ask me. Okay, so ooh, there's the uh, there's the maneuvering skills. That's fine. That's good. I was wondering. Because 
Last time I played, for some reason, I didn't see these, and I got my butt whooped. So where are we gonna go? There's a lot of clouds. Let's let's just let's start out over here. It's a good idea to keep our ships together, because Tyranid ships, they're base, they're kind of expendable. Oh, and a uh, funny little thing, they don't really have shields. That is really loud music. Uh, sorry, it's just stu stupendously loud music. Uh, funny thing about they don't really have shields. They have these swirling masses of smaller creatures, which act as uh, armor, basically. An extra layer of defense. And it's also your point defense. So if you lose your shields, you also lose your point defense. Which really just kind of drives home the whole point of the Tyranid fleet, which is to just dive in as quickly as possible, eat everything as quickly as possible. Uh, we're going to keep some small dudes over here. And we're going to try to keep most of our fleet together for this engagement. Let's move forward. Everybody move forward. And just go ahead and... Yeah, like that. That's how you're supposed to close the distance. And there's a slight cooldown on that. The hive ship will cover your flanks. Ooh, so we got two over there, one over there, and two over there. Oh, and there's the Space Titans. Slowly entering the battlefield. Wow, how much... Oh my gosh, there's a bajillion of them. This, uh, that, that's not good. Uh, we're gonna have to eat those eventually. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. <laughs> Dudes, this might, this might turn out bad. Uh, all ahead full. Get in there and start taking points. Okay, Hive Ship will remain back here. You will also remain back here. And you dudes will be our scouting party. Brace for impact. Tracking sense. The enemy has seized a strategic area. Reload. Tracking sense. Everybody go into tracking sense mode. We have now also you seized, seized a strategic, a strategic area. area. Okay. That's fine. Uh, do you guys have anything? Everybody go to tracking sense. Ooh, okay, yeah. Start attacking. Burn retros. Are you in weapons range? Oh, you are currently not. Maneuver into that cloud field. Oh, there they are. Time to engage, boys. Looks like meat's back on the menu. Can, can you guys engage, please? The enemy has seized a strategic area. Please. Okay, let's let's slow this down. Uh oh, they've been identified. Uh, spore explosion. Ooh, you guys have a suicide bomb skill. Get in there. In that case, go ahead and just everybody just start attacking, please. I really like you to start doing that. Uh, start maneuvering again. Ouch. That hurt a lot. Oh, there's a huge spread of torpedoes coming. Move, maneuver, maneuver out of the way. And you, swarm mutation. Boarding action on that teeny tiny little ship right there. And... Oh no, it's a stasis field. And... Can you... Spore explosion! Yes! Yes! Nice! Another one! Another one bites the dust! One collateral troops lost, you are going down. Feeder tentacles! Actually, okay, you don't have any. Turn this way. Okay, you can now use boarding action. 
And brace for impact. Okay. I was worried there for a second. And can you still use your feeder tentacles? Probably not. You are fine. Everybody else, keep up the good work. Actually, we're not we're not doing very good work. You need to you need to move closer. Uh, who has the fighters? Everybody needs to move in closer. Actually, psychic scream, biomorph wrecking ball. I thought I had at least one. I guess I don't. All right, you don't. So you're a drifting Hulk. That's fine. Turn around immediately, and. Okay. The enemy has seized a strategic Brace for impact. Area. That guy is on his own. We're gonna eat him. Let's see. Can you use your feeder tentacles? No. Burn retros. Turn, turn, turn. He's gonna ram you. That's not good at all. Not before we ram him first. Ah! Oh, glorious. Okay, insert your feeder tentacles. And you guys, all start om nom and that guy. You have amazing... Oh, hook tentacles. Draw him closer. Yes! Now everybody can do boarding actions. Oh, look at him. He's just being consumed. He's a drifting hulk in seconds. In seconds, we just annihilate him. That is so good. Okay, now everybody move away from him because he will explode if we shoot him too much. Start attacking that guy. Everybody, hit him, hit him harder. Start maneuvering. You can't brace for impact just yet, which is fine. How are the Space Titans doing? Oh my gosh, they are on the battlefield. Actually, I kind of want you to go over there. And uh, I want both of you, actually, to take that. Just move over there. You are about to die. Let's get all of our troops together. Can you guys please just get in there and take it? There we go. That guy is foolish. Foolishly chasing down the Tyranids. He's gonna die. Ooh, critical hit. That's not good. Does he have a... Bo no, that's that's a massive battleship. Let's set that guy as priority one. Okay, good. There is now a mutiny going on on that ship. Can you run? No, you can't. Okay, tracking senses, everybody. You're all on tracking sense. Fine. I want you to go faster. We need to go fast, dang it! Gosh darn it, why aren't you going fast? <sighs> His weapons have been damaged. He can't use tentacles anymore. Oh no! The Japanese will be so disappointed. The good thing is, there are only a couple of enemy ships left. You need to get back here. Is there any way to rally anybody? Breeding pool, replacement troops, psychic scream, or biomorph wrecking ball, nope. Uh, we need to move you up. Okay, they're directly in the path of that space titan. So they're probably gonna want to try to get out of there. Uh, swarm mutation, get your, get your shields back. Or whatever those are. Prepare to engage- Oh no! Oh no! Get out of there! Hive fleet! The hive ship. Okay. I was worried that those torpedoes were gonna kill us all. Okay, so now we can engage them. While they are confused by all of those space whales. Identified. Great, great, great. Uh, hook tentacle dudes. Ooh, we could probably use the biomorph wrecking ball. Let's move you forward. 
Let's just hold on a second. Yes, wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. It's gonna be glorious. Uh, turn a little bit, actually. Or, or don't. Buy a more fucking ball. N now, do it. Boom! That just hit two of them. Oh, that was glorious. Absolutely glorious. Now, everybody, get in there. Start attacking everything. Uh, swarm mutation. Can you do a boarding action? Yes, you can. Psychic scream. Eliminate their ability to think. Actually, you guys are gonna focus. Move around here. What is wrong with you? Why can't you move? You're gonna get eaten by a space whale. Okay, we got a mutiny on that ship. Boarding action, because why not? Uh, he's gonna get eaten by the space whale. Don't eat my babies. My beautiful space babies. Oh, here's some broadside action going on here. Oh, look at that. He's actually sending out the critters, his own shields, basically, to uh, attack the enemy ship. Ouch. That hurt a lot. Okay. Uh, they're definitely not going to win by points. I didn't want that to be a thing. Either way. Uh, you just keep doing what you're doing. Get out of there. We need to move on to that last big old ship. Can you do a boarding action? No. How about you brace for impact? <laughs> well, you did what you could. You have accumulated 25% of strategic points. Anyway, we need to completely we need to overwhelm that their uh battleship. You can turn around and The enemy has accumulated 25% of strategic points. Do what you can. Points. Slow him down. Oh, you got bio torpedoes? So much the better. Turn around immediately. Well, uh, this should be enough to take on that guy. Uh, but where's your bio torpedoes? Oh. Fire! Oh. They wiped it out with their point defense. Darn. Okay. Well, you're not going to be able to do much to hold him back then. But do what you can. You are the Tyranids. You do not run away. Well, actually, it'd be better to just uh, keep all of our ships together at this point. We've taken quite a few losses. And if we want to completely om nom this guy, then we're going to have to... Oh, can we do the Biomorph Wrecking Ball again? I would love to. Oh, are those, are those torpedoes? Nope. That's just a... Uh, that's just a thing. That's just his regular... Um, cannons. But let's do the Biomorph Wrecking Ball. Boom! He's taking severe morale damage, which is fine. He's still being hit hard. But we need to completely... Okay. Where's your... Where are your feeder tentacles? I just had... You, just, you were just in range of them. Draw them in. Yes, pull them closer. I want to hit them with my teeth. Do you have feeder tentacles? Nope, you just have boarding action. That's fine. Everybody's going to do boarding actions anyway. You can. You should be able to do that. Yep, there you go. What on earth is happening? I think one of the space whales just... Oh, no. One of our ships just bit the dust. Can you do Psychic Scream again yet? No, not for another 43 seconds. He's taking shelter behind the Space Whale. Curses. 
What will the space whale do? Nothing. It's just a, it's literally just an obstacle. That's fine. Uh, you. Brace for impact! And hit him hard! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. They're being completely annihilated. Swarm mutations for everybody. Ah, okay. Deck has been destroyed. They're running. Turn around and finish them off. And the space whales just keep coming. Let's eat them. Oopsie. Colliding with a space whale is not conducive to Tyranid health. I did not know that colliding with the space whale would cause quite that much damage. Can you at least do a boarding action on the space whale? No. Can you do feeder tentacles on the space whale? That would be interesting. Yes, you can! <laughs> Eat it! Eat the whale! Although there's no crew to devour, so it doesn't really do anything. Either way. Um, I don't think we're going to get around it, so we just need to go behind it. And a battery just went out on my face cam, but I probably don't really need face cam on this battle anyway. Let's go ahead and finish this. You, turn around. Prepare for immediate engagement. Psychic scream. And begin the feeding. Glorious. Let's watch this last Imperial ship go down. Swarm mutation. Boarding actions. Turn. And can we use the Biomorph Wrecking Ball one more time? Yes, we can. <laughs> None shall escape the wrath of the swarm. Boo! Oh, well, okay. That he, that one will probably escape the wrath of the swarm, but not for much longer. Morning actions galore. Brace for impact. Ram the crap out of him. And he just... Oh my goodness gracious! He just ate. He just devoured that ship. That was so cool! Oh, man! The Hive Fleet shall feast tonight. Victory. Glorious victory. I guess a randomly generated Imperial battle group by extermination. That was so cool. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. That was my first skirmish battle. I will definitely make more. If you liked it, don't forget to leave a like. And remember, I am a Wolverman, your captain. And I will see you all on the next voyage. Bye-bye.